Hey everyone, Ryan here. You may know me from doing the voice of Cobra and Kobu. Um, I'm here with I'm here with Sarah Jones, um, from the one who does the voice of the Tarnian Sarah. Sarah, are you up for it? Yep. Um, so we actually explain what what we're doing. Yes. Uh, today we're going to be looking at we're going to be doing a commentary for Scars Pride of the Osprey, and every part we show. We're going to be kind of just, just describing some bits and bobs. Now, for those of you who claimed I didn't get permission, follow the link in the follow the link in the description below for proof that I got permission to a uh, view. It goes by the offspring. Anyway, so part one. Now there isn't much in this one, is there? Not really. Well, let's just uh, let's just uh, have a look and see. Here we go. Right, here we go. And we begin. Here we go. So it's uh, you can see on the top it says Sulabi's Scars Pride. In a minute, the offspring's gonna be on there. The Lion King God version. So you can actually see that um, this takes place. After the Lion King one, but it's for, it's a fan made story, so it's basically like saying what what happened um what happened if Scar did kill Simba, yeah, and of course we don't know how that would end up. Well, we got a little story here to um basically show you what it is. Now, by the way, we have got some singing in this, and I'm pretty sure this one you'll sing this one, Sarah, with the character of Sarabi, correct? Correct. Yes, Sarah is also playing Sarabi as well. I think Matthew is probably good at playing Scar. I mean, he's got experiences of playing Scar, playing the villain. Now, sorry about the little mistake error, but it's the little error. I now see the path. To our rightful return to power. I think that's probably gonna be one of my favourite lines. Yeah, because um, in the original, it was Sarah saying, I now see the path to our glorious return to power. Right, here we go. It, here's um, Sarah singing my lullaby, so Robbie's version. I've been exiled, persecuted, left alone with no offence. When I think of what that brute did, I get a little tense. But I dream my dreams so pretty that I don't feel so depressed. Can soothe my little kitty and it helps me get some rest. The sound of scars dying gas. You can see the lyric change. He starts off screaming in my grasp. His violence is more fine. That's my love. Now the past now I try forgetting, and my fools I could forgive. Trouble is I know it's pity, but I hate to let them live. So you find yourself somebody who chased God up a tree. Oh, the battle um, at the end of the part scene, I was supposed to, I was, uh, I was supposed to credit so myself um, playing and doing, uh, taking part in this but song as well. It's in the death of oh my That's my love I see they have some good singing there Yeah, you do don't you? <laughs> Classic You are a good singer Seriously I mean you and I have got experiences of singing Love of Run Away You know, uh, Lion King 2 before Yeah, that is true Right, so in case you guys didn't hear because of the thing, basically, um, I was supposed to credit myself being part of the song My Lullaby, because in the, at the in, in the credits I done it with just Sarah just singing that song. I didn't actually realize it was a duet. In. Anyway, guys, that is actually it from us. We'll be back with part two. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time. See you. Bye.